Jason. You're watching March's Outdoor Adventures. Line set up, ready to go. Time to shoot him in the face. CBA's new Acura MR. Its premium Bergara barrel guarantees it to be the most accurate muzzleloader you've ever shot. Or your money back. Visit CBA.com for details.
Okay, Eric, what kind of cameras you got there? Browning. Browning what? Recon Cooler. What model? Recon. 8 megapixel. Got the night vision infrared. It's a nice camera. Hey, right, let's take a look and see what kind of pictures we get coming up out of there. Alright, I'll turn it on. Uh, I have right here the buck bar with uh, up your odds OI OI uh, outdoors and right behind me here we got a corn some corn and an apple mineral lick apple mineral lick, apple mineral lick. Salt. salt lick and what we're going to do is we're going to bury this right to the left of it and we have a show cam picture camera right here uh, right off to the left of me and we're going to bury this and we're going to see what happens and check the trail cam pictures and, uh, next 20 days. in the next 20 days and see what gets hit harder. Alright, so uh, here we go. Before I go to bury this, let me give you a close up and uh, show you what, what we're looking at. That's a mineral attractant. Man, smells good. I wish you had smell o vision. And uh, we're going to take a look at it and see what happens. And to add insult to injury, well, I shouldn't say insult to injury, we're going to sprinkle something else on there. Haha, -ha. shake and bait. Shake and bait. <laughs> And that's not even half of it that we used. Where's that hole at? Right underneath you. Right here? Yeah. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm upping my odds. Shaking bait. We're going to see what happens. Shaking bait. We're going to see what happens, all right? Thanks, guys. So, we got the buck bar and shake and bake. Either way you want to go. CVA. Hey, thanks for watching March's Outdoor Adventures. It's time for me to get back to work.
here we are at a different location, a different feeding site, a lot of gnats out here. We have another camera set up just off to my left, and uh, we're going to put out some more shake and bake, and another piece of that buck bar. But we're not going to bury this one though. They may just take a piece of that. hope so. Spread it out and just drop it. Crumble some up here. That'll keep that spot active year round. Yes, sir. Now we're going to let this sit for 20, 20 days and then we're going to come back and check the trail cams. A little bit of shake and bake on this side. Again, I still got half a, half a container left. This is a year round deer track attractive, the buck bar, a year round deer attractive, shaking big, up your odds. Here it is, actually more than 20 days later, and the pictures that are getting ready to come up is, are of everything that was digging in this hole where we put the uh, buck bar at, and that's the hole that was dug trying to get to the buck bar. Get you some. Come early spring, it's getting green. Fisher on the bed, and hear those turkeys gobble. It's ringing in my head. The CBA Acura V2 with its premium Bergara barrel. The Acura is guaranteed to outshoot any other muzzle loader or your money back. Visit CPA.com for details. Hi, thank you for watching another episode of Marsh's Outdoor Adventures. Today we're down here at Deer Creek and we are with a first timer here at the archery range. Uh, this is his first time uh, shooting a um, 12 gauge and a 20 gauge so we're going to be checking them out and giving some pointers and um, helping them out along the way and this coming September this upcoming dove season uh, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be having him out um, on camera hunting for dove for his first time so I'm going to introduce you to James his name is James Walker one of the good guys I go to church with and he's a really good guy so wish him luck guys alright alright this is James Walker, a really good friend of mine from the church, and today is his first time uh, shooting with the 12 gauge and a 20 gauge. And like I said, hopefully we can get him out there this dove season, get him ready to go. As you can see, he got his headgear on, safety, perfect. Thanks, Pops, for that one. Appreciate it. And he got his glasses on, also eye protection. We do also have other eye protection and other ear protection just in case. So we're going to get started. But first, let me give you a look and see and show you what we're going to be shooting with today. All right, the first one we have here is the 410, so we're going to start off with that, and then we have the 20 gauge single shot, and then we have the Mossberg 500 pump 12 gauge, and then we have uh, the Ruger SR9C, the Glock 17, 19. Glock 19, I'm sorry, and then we have the Smith & Wesson um, 22 MP, all right, so we're going to get started, enjoy. Don't forget, pull that hammer back. Now this is the 410 he's shooting for right now. And uh, as you can see, not too bad. So James, are you ready to move on to the 20 gauge? I'm ready. Let's do this. 20 gauge it is. Same, uh, same principle, same thing. All right. How's it feel? Adds a little kick to it. Oh yeah. 
Alright, now, now he's going to try to slug. Uh, it's for a smooth barrel slug, so we're going to check that out. So how does it feel to you so far? Not bad. Okay, but did you see what I was saying about the kick from going from the 410 to the 20 gauge? It's a little bit more kick, but yeah. and also has a little bit more power. But they also make a low recoil yeah, round. So look for those if you're uh, still a little timid a about shooting a higher gauge shotgun. Line, All right, yeah. have at it, James. Wow, look at that. One straight shot. That's his shot right there. Oh my. Good job. Nice. Thank you. I think somebody's ready for deer season. <laughs> Alright, now you saw how we did with the uh, 20 gauge. So now we're going to do the uh, 12 gauge uh, pump and see how he does with that. Uh, again, like I was explaining to you in the la in just a few minutes ago, we uh, they do make a low recoil round. Uh, Remington, as far as I know, uh, from all the ones that I've shot, uh, make a really good manageable recoil round. It's, it's what they call a lower recoil round for those that are more timid about shooting a 12 gauge or a 20 gauge. Um, when you go to your store, this is what you look for. All right, that's the Remington low recoil. This is a 12 gauge round, uh, but it's really nice so not that bad uh, but it's very manageable low recoil round so he has two here so we're going to take a look and uh, see how he does you ready I'm ready you're nervous yeah a little bit all right now have you ever done a pump before never okay let me give you here hold these and I'll give you a quick lesson all right your safety much like unlike the uh, single shot you have a safety on here the only safety you have on there is your trigger and the hammer Right. Okay. With the pump, there's a button here. This is my Mossberg. All right, a Mossberg 500. You just hold this button, and that puts in a shell. Okay. Okay. Eject your shell by pressing that button. When you're ready. Okay. See what here? You can put a shell in at the at the breech, and then you're ready to go. Okay. When you eject it, once you're fired a weapon or the firearm, excuse me. Once you fire it. You wrap it, and it's ready to go. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna show him how to do the first one. All right. So stay tuned and uh, have fun. All right. Again, uh, again, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this first shot, just as an example to James, and then uh, we'll let him take a look at it, and hopefully we can all survive this. You ready? And as simple as that, getting the job done. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to ha have James step up and take a look, and uh, we'll take a couple of shots and see how he likes it. Make sure he's ready to go up to the big boy. are locked in ready to go so once you fire pull back rack it pull the trigger again rack and you're good to go all right all right here we go fingers crossed watch that safety there you go there you go good job Good job. So, how did it feel? Feels good. You like it? I like it. Which one you like better, 12, 20, or 410? I think I'm good with the 12. All right. <laughs> yeah. 
He, you heard him. The Mossberg 500. It's the way to go. Oh, yeah, you need a, uh, I've got a watch right there in the top of my Mossberg. I hope you're watching this because uh, right I'm just playing. <laughs> but uh, so, congrats to James. Like the video. Hit that little like button down here on the bottom. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, like us on Facebook. Just follow this link right here, and you're good to go. All right. Thank you. Oh yeah. By the way, before I forget, check these guys out right here. Awesome product and. Uh, we thank him for sending the hat, all right, for the uh, product spotlight spot. So thank you very much, and uh, we appreciate it. This product, uh, Concord Whitetail Scents, uh, they, they, they have a numerous amount of scents going on right now, and uh, they're already uh, ready to go. They're fresh, they're good, and uh, a wide variety. So look them up on Facebook, okay? It's Concord Scents, all right? So take a look at them. Thanks for watching.